Hey guys, I'm LB, and we got a request from Sadather to play Butterbridge by Sadather. It hasn't been an easy task, but I think I managed to build an interesting test chamber using funnel and light bridge. And buttons, but that's not the point. Even though it doesn't match the imagination of my friends who have mastered the art of testing, I'm fairly confident that I come up with something original and fun. By the way, you might find a strange, invisible, but tiny wall that blocks cubes somewhere in the map. I won't tell you where it is. Feel free to look for it. If you find it... 1. I don't know what happened. 2. It doesn't have anything to do with the intended solution. 3. I doubt you'll make profit from it. 4. Feel free to laugh and joke about it. It's Wheatley's fault anyway. Uh, if it's Wheatley's fault, then how did you write number 1? I don't know how that happened. Why did I name it Butterbridge, you ask? Because it's the name of a level in Super Mario World, Super Nintendo Entertainment System 1990, and I love this game that made my childhood. Alright, well, hopefully we won't have to deal with the invisible wall. You know what? Uh, do you have an angled panel in this map? Because that could, that could do it, let's see. Uh, angled panel, yeah. So, what happens is, with angled panels, sometimes their collision with cubes can get stuck a little bit, and, uh, the cube will collide, but not the player. I've seen it happen in many maps, it's even happened in my own maps, and I don't know what causes it in the game, but yeah, that- that happens, it's just a thing that angled panels do sometimes. Okay, so this is our funnel, and that is our light bridge, and I think this drops on entering, but it does not automatically respawn. Alright. Oh, and does this- Oh, and that just- that just turns it off, so we can only use one at a time, apparently. Uh... Where do we want to go, though? How do I get anywhere? Am I missing something? There's deadly goo everywhere. I'm not really seeing where I need to be going here. There's no portal stuff there. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what to do, to begin here. I am already stumped. I, I haven't even done anything in the map yet, and I'm already stumped. I must be missing something obvious. Because if I- if I take the funnel into this area, I'm just gonna trap myself. And looking at the picture here, it doesn't look like there's anything over in this area that I'd want to go to. That just makes it smaller. What to do, what to do? Oh, right, okay. I know what we need to do. We wanna shuffle the cube over to this... over here. There we go. That should do it. There we go, there we go, let's see. This guy is sort of in a- in a bind, but I can fix him. We have the technology. There we go. We use the technology called crouching to fix the cube. Right, so now, we have the light bridge. And that makes things a lot easier. And this is just the way back, yep. See, this drops that guy. Does that auto-respawn? I guess not. No, it does not. Alright. Well, that's perfectly fine. Is it really, though? What does this do? Oh. Okay, well, we don't need that right this second. 
we do need is not that. <laughs> I'll tell you that much, it's not that. Definitely not that. Maybe... We just need to reach out and grab it. So I put this... about there-ish. Not like that. Oh, not like that. Yes, like that. But not like that. <laughs> wow. Need to make this jump. How did I grab it before? It's so far away. How did I grab it? Man. Well, that's I mean, yeah, that's that's one way to grab it, but then you die right afterwards. I shouldn't do the thing where you jump forward and then fall backward, but yeah, I'm not good at that. How are you supposed to do this part? How did I do it once, and then not again? Hey! Save. There we go. There we go. Sorry if that's not the correct way to do it together. Okay, so now that we've done this, I think we could just funnel our way to victory. Potentially. Oh, I was in the funnel, I- I even felt it! I felt it, I heard it, I heard it, I felt it. I was in the funnel. Just gotta try that one more time. Okay, that- okay, maybe more than one more time, perhaps. <laughs> I wish the loading times weren't so long in this game. Apparently Vintage used to have to sit on loading screens for two to three minutes, which I had no idea about. Ooh, that was... that was bad. Can I do that, please? Maybe if I failed to jump, I hit just no-clip instead of sitting through the long loading screen again. Let's see here. Oh man, that was a terrible jump. That was absolutely terrible. I need to start more to the left. <laughs> I need to need to get a bit of a longer run up in order to make that work. Yes, did it. Did it. I have brought the optional companion cube to the exit. Well guys, as always, thank you for watching, I really appreciate it. You can show your appreciation with the two buttons below the video that look like these right here, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!